I'm going to take a minute and kind of go over just the, the basics of tactical arbitrage, okay? Now, for those who may be catching the replay, anybody who's watching in the background, maybe you didn't want to leave a comment, maybe you didn't want to do anything, and you're wondering, what is this software he, he keeps talking about? This software, Tactical Arbitrage, will actually search hundreds and hundreds of websites and allow you know, but you to search for products under all categories. And the purpose is to pull back potential profit bearing products that you can make money with. It does so much of the heavy lifting for you. And we're actually, we might as well show you right off the bat, just to give you an idea of some of the different sites. And remember, we're talking not just in the United States. You've got the UK, Canada, Germany, India, Australia, and on and on it goes. But just in the US, look at the different sites that this software will search for you. Some of them don't have the actual logos loaded, but you can just see. I mean, look at look at where we are here. We haven't even scratched the surface. Look at these. There is no way you're going to be able to do all of this by hand when you're looking for a particular product and you want to check every store that happens to have it. Wow, it is absolutely amazing what you can do with this product. So let's go back real quick. What we're going to do, we're going to take a quick glance at everything along the left-hand margin, okay? Um, you can put it on dark mode if you prefer that. Uh, that's a fairly recent option. I came in light whenever it was light, so I haven't gotten used to that. Maybe one day I will. The first thing you look at is your dashboard, and you look at different things. So you can see I've been a member since March of 2018. OK, right away, you can see what searches you have active, how many you have have completed that you haven't deleted yet. You've got your rubies. We'll talk about that a little bit down the road. And basically, it's just an overview. Now, you can see I have product search. I have Amazon flips, reverse search, wholesale and library. And mostly you can see all all I really use is products, reverse search and wholesale. So. The next one down the screen is going to be your actual product search, okay? What a product search is, is you telling the software, hey, search a particular site and look for certain categories or however you designate, you know, when you go into your filters. But what you're telling the product is you're going to pick the particular site or sites, because you can have a search across multiple sites. But just to give you a quick look at it, what you're going to, in product search, you're going to pick the website. Okay. That's different than reverse search, which we will come to later. The next one we're going to look at is called reverse search. Now, reverse search is different. Reverse search, you don't tell the software to look at a particular store. Reverse search, you say, hey, I want to scan all, for example, all of the best sellers in a particular category. And I'm picking categories, arts and crafts, automotive, baby products, beauty and personal care, and on and on and on. So that one is really, really good because then, you're not saying just search Target, just search Walmart. You're saying, hey, scan best sellers. Look for, for example, toys and games and and go search every every site for my criteria. And we'll get into criteria and stuff like that in another at another time. We're just kind of going an, an overview. You can also do what they call a wholesale search. That's if you want, say you found a wholesaler and what wholesalers will generally do is provide you with a, uh, with a spreadsheet that's just full of different products and you, you don't have the time to try and go over. It could be easily thousands of products. 
and you can plug that in. Now, of course, that's a different level in terms of what what membership you have. OK, but that's what wholesale is about. Then you have Amazon flips. I don't hear people talk about flips as much as they used to. But an Amazon flip is where you buy a product from Amazon, let Amazon ship it to you, then turn right around and sell it on the platform. If you do that, uh, you don't want to use your prime membership for that. OK, just as an aside. Um, You've got your library search. That's if you're specifically into books. There's nothing about that feature that I have found personally that's any better than either a product search or a reverse search when it comes to books. You do have a feature we talked about last week called Always Be Scanning. Catch that replay. Always Be Scanning says this. It says, hey, I don't feel like going in and setting up a search. I'd like for the software to always be running scans. And then when I have a minute, five minutes, 10 minutes, I can just come right to always be scanning, go through the results and see if there's something because time is of the essence. Moving right along, guys, you have your search manager. We sort of touched on that. This gives you an overview of what you have currently queued up, which is another a fancy way of saying running. I've got a, a toys and games reverse search going. It's already got over a thousand products it's checked over 142,000 and you could tab through your completed searches your saved let's say you had a a saved search you can set that to auto run whenever you want periodically that is a huge feature because that takes uh instead of it's, it's almost like setting up your always be scanning okay and you set the stores the categories whatever it is that you want it and now we're uh let's see now you have your your analysis analysis could be used for example uh one that you might want to look at is tactical edge okay tactical edge gives you a lot more data on a particular product again you know when it comes to to selling on amazon it's all about understanding how to evaluate. Okay. So you've got things like variations. Uh, I tell you what, some of these we're going to have to get into this box calculator. Uh, I've never seen, look at this. What is that? Bundleizer. Uh, that'd be great. Yeah, we got to go through some of these. The only ones that they used to have was tactical edge and variations. And maybe the 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 uh the your matches. So we will get into that as we as we move on. Recycle bin, whenever you delete products, they go into the bin and then they're eventually deleted. Uh view inventory, that is actually connected with your account with your Amazon account and it will show you your inventory and there's a lot you can do with that maybe we'll get into that at some point when you come over to resources if you've been um if you've used the software for any length you you'll be able to tell that uh they've changed the layout quite a bit look at the videos that they have they've changed that entire layout You've got quick a quick start video, dashboard, product search, pretty much everything you would need. They have a video on it. So, and then, of course, you've got your support, and they're they're actually they're not they're not immediate. There's no number to call, but they do get back with you. So. That's pretty much what we wanted to cover for the overview. If you have any questions about that, you guys already know I'm here to help. Uh, my number is always available. Here, I'll put it up for you. If you ever need to connect, if you ever have any questions, 347-566-1000.